So you move along the back of the DX7 and then you end up with this, which is the power cable. And as you can see, it's a long power cable to a plug at the end of it. Now I'm not particularly in favour of this type of arrangement for a couple of reasons. Um, especially in my studio where I have a UPS for my keyboards. Um, it doesn't allow me to plug into a UPS because a UPS is expecting a, an integrated circuit board uh, style connection. So in order to do that what I would always recommend is putting one of these uh, in the cable and therefore you can then use it with a, an integrated circuit board style cable and straight into the back of my UPS which is eventually where this is going. So in order to do that I'm just going to cut this off about there, put that on it and then we can use it as a, a, a different cable setup. So there you go, a few minutes work, IC connector put on there which will allow me to uh, plug this in to the same power supply as the rest of the equipment.